is coming in from the United States as US Director of National Intelligence John Ratcliffe has now called China the greatest threat to democracy and freedom worldwide since World War II. Ratcliffe, who served the House of Representatives Intelligence Committee for a brief period of time, came down heavily on China in an opinion piece that he wrote for the Wall Street Journal. The U.S. intel chief called China a national security threat. He described operations in which China used economic pressure to influence or undermine U.S. legislators. He said that China's economic espionage approach was threefold, rob, replicate and replace which means steal American companies' intellectual property, copy it, and then supplant U.S. companies in the global market. Ratcliffe also accused Chinese authorities of conducting human testing on members of the Chinese army in hopes of developing soldiers with biologically enhanced capabilities. He added that Chinese leaders seek to subordinate the rights of the individual to the will of the Communist Party. They exert government control over companies and subvert the privacy and freedom of their citizens with an authoritarian surveillance state. Washington and Beijing have clashed over China's handling of COVID-19, its tightening grip on Hong Kong, disputed claims in the South China Sea, and even human rights crimes in Xinjiang. Beijing has frequently called on U.S. to dial down the anti-China rhetoric. U.S. President Donald Trump took a tough stance against China. This has taken relations between the world's two largest economies to their lowest point in decades. Of the spike molecule that Dr.